This video will focus on logging into and out of Polaris Leap. Just a reminder, Polaris Leap is Polaris. Any patron data entered in previous versions of Polaris, for example, reading history, will automatically be present in Polaris Leap. The recommended second browser, if Firefox is unavailable, is Google Chrome. You must begin any actions in Polaris Leap by opening Polaris Leap. On any Windows 10 library computer, click on the Firefox desktop icon labeled Leap. If your library has not yet upgraded to Windows 10, open Firefox, the recommended browser, and go to staff.buckles.org. Click Leap and Polaris Leap will open. Use the same username and password that were used for previous versions of Polaris. Click Sign In. If you're on a workstation with Polaris installed, the correct library and workstation are automatically selected. If you're on any non-Buckles workstation, the correct library will be automatically selected, but the workstation will need to be selected. And Leap will open. When you've finished working in Leap and you're ready to log out, at the top right next to your login name, click the drop down arrow and choose Log Out. You'll get a message that says this operation will close any open work forms and unsaved changes will be lost. Are you sure you wish to log off Polaris Sleep? You will always get this message even if you haven't opened anything. Polaris Sleep just wants to be sure that you really want to close it. So click continue and you will be returned to the Polaris Sleep login page. It is important to save and close work forms before logging out because unsaved items will not be saved. If a browser window is hard closed or the browser crashes, there is the potential for open work forms to become locked so no one else can edit them. This requires contacting the Buckles office to fix the issue. It is important to log out of Polaris Leap at the end of the day or end of shift. By doing so, you can see which workstations have completed each action. Just closing a browser window will not properly log off Polaris Leap or save any in-progress work. And now you know how to log into and out of Polaris Leap.